The main features of the Mundus Map program obviously deal with uh, public policy. Public policy means different things to different audiences, but in our program we uh, problematize it in a variety of uh, different literatures. Uh, and uh, the ISS track focuses a bit more on the politics of uh, policy making. So Mundus Map is a kind of uh, interdisciplinary program that uh, seeks to kind of understand public policy problems um, from a, a kind of conceptual and analytical uh, framework. So giving students uh, different theories and concepts and analytical tools to understand how problems not only emerge but then the, the history of these problems. Okay, so I was really like attracted by, by this program because it has like a critical approach. Uh, I didn't want to go to a university just to memorize things and apply them. I wanted like something like challenging, like more analytic and ISS is really well known for that. And I also wanted like the opportunity to have like a interdisciplinary approach because I'm a lawyer, but I didn't want like that so formal and stuff, so I wanted like to to have some background also like in economics, international relations, so those were like the main reasons to choose this program. Well, my perspective of um, the relationship that I have with the students from Mundus Map is, is, is very much informed by my own understanding that we are both learning. This is an environment to co-learn. Um, so the way in which I relate to my students is in a way that is very horizontal. Professors really go out of their way to make sure that you're comfortable because they understand a lot of, well, basically every student is an international student in The Hague, um, and so they, they make, go out of their way to make sure that students feel comfortable, but then also that they're uh, following up on, on the lessons and that they uh, are pushing you to really uh, think about what you're learning in the classroom and, and of course, you can take this beyond the confines of the classroom and, and go to the butterfly bar or go to uh, more comfortable spaces where you can speak more informally and casually with professors who uh, you know, become close friends in the end. We are uh, collaborating among different institutes with different knowledges, uh, embedded in different cultural settings, also embedded in different uh, uh, regulatory frameworks at the same time. And it also offers students to interact in all of these different settings at, uh, at the same time. Yeah, so um, in a way it kind of has a comparative perspective built into it by, by situating uh, over two years students in different locations. Uh, you're naturally going to be exposed to different kinds of uh, perspectives within the two schools and two institutions that we uh, take part in. So you have, uh, for example, you, you can go to the Netherlands and second year you spend it either in Barcelona or in York in England, they're all great places. Uh, yeah, I will, I will for sure advise to come to this master because I mean like in many, like in my studies before, you were asked to memorize some things, I applied them just because that's the way it should be. Here is all the opposite. Here you need to understand the things, you need to think for yourself if you believe in that or no, and you need to have reasons and argument to think about the things. So I think if we're here, it's because we want to change something, it's because we want to challenge like complex problems. So it's the best way to do it, like that you become like a critique person, that you understand, and after you can really go back to your country like to make a change. But it's becoming like a critique person, otherwise you can do it. So I will really advise to join this program.